in the heart of the jungle. The resonating thumbs of chess meeting signal a mature display of power and dominance. <laughs> These are not the sounds of a schoolyard brawl, but rather the clash of two silverback gorillas competing for their place at the top. These animals are normally known for being gentle giants, so why do they fight? Primarily, silverback gorillas fight to establish dominance. A silverback gorilla serves as the alpha male of its troop and will battle with other males to protect its status. This ensures that the group remains organized and gives a sense of security to the female gorillas and their young. Other times they fight to protect their family against other rival troops. Silverbacks are also fiercely territorial and will fight to protect the boundaries of their troops territory. As for the female mountain gorillas, they are an integral part of the competition between males to establish dominance. When a dominant silverback discovers another male advancing towards one of the females in its troop, it will often fight with the intruder. This type of aggression is usually more severe than other fights between silverbacks because it involves defending their territory and mates. If the intruder is unsuccessful, the dominant silverback will remain in charge and continue to mate with the females in its troop. But if successful, the invading male will take over as alpha and establish his own harem of female gorillas. Fierce as they may be, silverback fights are rarely fatal. Instead, they rely on posturing and intimidating display of strength to demonstrate who's in charge. They may use their massive size six feet or hit the ground with their fists to create a terrifying atmosphere. But it isn't just physical display of power that these gorillas use to make their point. They may also let out loud roars, throw rocks or branches, and even engage in playful chasing. While silverbacks look aggressive, their aggression is pretty rare in stable groups. The most severe form of aggression between silverbacks is when two troops meet and the leading males battle it out. In such cases, silverbacks use their powerful canines to inflict deep wounds to eliminate the competition for good. Although these fights rarely end in death, they are very serious and can be extremely dangerous for both animals involved. So, the next time you think of a silverback gorilla, don't just picture the brawny chest-thumping alpha. Instead, imagine a fiercely loyal protector holding the fort with a roguish charm that's hard to overlook. After all, it's not just about the fight, it's about the love, loyalty and the lengths a gorilla will go to to protect its own.